Hello and welcome. This is my favorite type of video to make. I hope it is your favorite type of video to watch. It is time for a Dollar Tree haul. If you want to see what I got at the Dollar Tree today, please stay tuned. I'm gonna give it a try Maybe this year I won't be sad on Christmas Maybe I'll have a happy holiday Replace my heartache and my pain With mistletoe and candy canes This Christmas I go my way I've never seen a reindeer fly Okay, um This is kind of a mixed haul um, but very much a Christmas haul. Um, we've got some more Christmas items. Um, so here we go. Um, I, we found this to go cup that has the little truck that everyone is going crazy over. All over it, and this little red thing totally pops off, and put, and you can't put it back on. But for my personal reasons, I do not like these little. I know these are supposed to help not burn your hand, but I do not like these. So my personal felt like this. This thing will be off of it. Uh, but, and you can see that it is, the pattern is all the way off with or without it. So if you do take that off, you're not going to have a gap. Um, but I've never burnt myself on these cups with or without that little foam thing. So I will take it off. So it says little snow people all over it and then the little truck. And it does have own the door of the truck and the tailgate of the truck. I do not know if you can even see. Merry Christmas wrote. Oh, I don't think you can see it too good. But it's Merry Christmas on the little door. And on the little tailgate. So. This is a good winter cup, but it does have Merry Christmas wrote on that. So Technically a Christmas cup, but I would probably use this throughout the winter just because it's snowmen and trucks and the Merry Christmas is very small. Um, this is a twist off lid and twist back on so it's no longer the lids that you used to have where they just pop on and off. These are twist on and they do seem to be a little bit better quality. These cups just seem like they're better quality than they've been having. Um, these are not recommended use for microwave or dishwasher. So if you use these, you don't need to put them in your dishwasher or your microwave because they may melt. Um, next thing is not Christmas, but I just wanted to show the cup. First thing, that cup, this is so cute. Okay, I hauled some pads before, and they weren't the ones I was looking for because someone else hauled these. These are the pads because I done opened them and made sure. These are the um, modest, basic pads that they have at the Dollar Tree. These are 10 of these, and they are, as you can see on the very side here, the bigger ones. These are the overnight. These are ultra thin with wings. Overnight, extra heavy. Um, they're the green ones. And for some reason, all the overnight things, no matter what the brand is, it's purple. But anyway, these, which I'm going to show you, are the longer pads, as you can see. They're the longer pads. Um, being a big girl, 
I have to have the longer pads. So these are very much going to be a, a trial thing. I'll, and I will try to put this pack when I finish them in my um, empties and give you a review if these work out good. Plus, if these work out good, these are going to be so much cheaper to buy three packs of these for $3 and get the same amount I'm getting at Walmart right now for $4. So, that's going to be uh, hopefully a good channel. Okay. Next bag is full of Christmas goodness. So, here we go. They have these little Tupperwares. They also have them with um, it had, at my store, they had one that had cookies, like a little cookie dish on it, and it said Sa cookies for Santa on it. We do not do Santa Claus here. So, we got the gingerbread man and gingerbread house. It says comfort and joy. Um, but these would be totally cute to do, like, little gift baskets in. You could even do like a little gift basket where you get the stuff to make cookies and put it in there and the person that you give it to can have the joy of making the cookies for Christmas and you have the gift. But you can also bake the cookies and give it to them in these too. So these totally are good little gift items. Because either you can make a little gift basket where you put the cookie mix and the stuff to decorate the cookies in here. Which you can get all at the Dollar Tree. Or you can bake the cookies yourself and give them the cookies as their gift. Either way, these are very cute for that idea. And this is just a cute little thing if you wanted to take something to somebody's house. Some kind of little dish also a very cute thing to have. Those are just plum cute. Um, we did find some more gift bags. I guess you guys are probably like, how many gift bags do you need? But anyway, we found some more very cute gift bags. And these are, some of these are smaller gift bags. Because I have hauled a lot of the bigger ones. But here's some of the smaller ones. Um, this is all cute and it's glittery. And there's no fallout. None whatsoever on this bag. So that's kind of cool. Um, but this is Merry Christmas and it's a snow family. Which I thought was cute. Um, this is also no fallout on the glitter. See? No glitter is on my hands. And this is snowflakes and ornaments. And it says... Do not open until the 25th of December. Which I thought it was cute. And they also had another variation of this that says no peeking. That was cute, but we didn't get it. Um, and another one. This had a little bit of fog, but not much. And it has like the lights and um, clothes hanger. And it says no well. Now two more bigger bags. Um, this one is just a present. It says Merry Christmas. And then I saw someone else haul this and I thought it was adorable. And I had to go get it. Um, it says Joy and has the two deers. And then on the side panel, it has two cute little bunny rabbits. I didn't even do the side panels, these others. Let's see. I think this one. Yeah, this is the stars. And on the smaller bags. Oh, okay. The Noel on the side panel has Merry Christmas. It's both. Yeah, both side panels are the same. It says Merry Christmas. Uh, they do not open. It's just ornaments. And the snow people. It's just snowflakes. So 
So we are going to put this back in the bag. Because the one that does pass fall out, I do not want glitter all over my room. There we go. Next bag has some more Christmas goodness in it. Um, and also randomness. Uh, I saw someone else haul these and had to have one. It has like the fur trim on it and then the buffalo check. And we do have a cricket and I have plans to make an initial or um, initial thing to put on here on the middle of it. I think that would be cute and white. And that would be a cute little stocking. Okay. This is a Thanksgiving thing, but I thought that was cute. It has pumpkins all over it for fall. So I thought that was cute. Um, and the next couple things could be perfect stocking stuffers. Um, and this one actually is a stocking stuffer for myself. I bet my dad to get it. Um, and if I thought about it, we got it. I've got well, I've got another one for someone else's stocking. But I didn't think of that. So maybe these will be at another store and I can get some more for some more stocking stuffers. But I definitely want one for myself because this is just too cool for school. Um, yes, I just dated myself with that. But anyway, it is a maze pen. It's got two of the little, like, pinball balls in there. And the rest of the pen is a maze. And you have to try to get the two little balls to meet at the bottom and then get them back to the top and so on and so on. Yes, I'm easily amused. <laughs> like, I think this little pen would be hours of fun for anybody that likes puzzles. And this would be a cute little thing if someone liked word puzzles or pseudo puzzles or some kind of puzzle. They like this would be a cute pen to have for that, too. If you're making, like, a little gift set where you're getting them their crossword puzzles and their sweet tail puzzles. This would be, like, cute to put with it because it's actually, it's a puzzle, too. Maybe it's just me, but I think that would be a cute idea. Um, they did have these back in stock. These are the emergency flashlights that you grind. Um, they are very bright, but you just charge them up like this. They don't require batteries. So you got anybody, I don't care who they are, you got anybody that you're doing stocking stuffers for, Get one of these and put it in their stocking because blackouts, any kind of disaster where you lose your power, everybody needs a flashlight. And you don't, I know that you get flat, you have flashlights on your phones, but the phones may die, the batteries may die. These won't. We got it in the purple, the black, and the red. And you may want to conserve your um, battery on your phone and have a separate flashlight. But I thought these were cute. Um, and these would be perfect stocking stuffers for anybody because everybody needs a flashlight in an emergency. And then the last thing in this bag is something we always try to get to put my dad's stocking. And that is Lifesavers Hard Rum, Butter Rum Candy. These are a staple for stockings in this house. Um, next bag, another 
really good stocking stuffer or gift. And I know all of you are going crazy over the buffalo chick this year. Bam. Yeah. The buffalo chick is in the slippers. Um, these are sizes 5 to 9. But I think they might even stretch to my foot size. Because they look pretty stretchable. See, they're pretty, they're pretty stretchable. And I wear about a 11, 12 wide in a woman's shoe, so. But they say 5, 9, so. Buffalo. Black and white spotted, and yes, even leopard. But these would be perfect gifts for uh, anybody that has that size foot. <laughs> Stock in stocking stuffers. Um, anybody that's in a nursing home probably would like these. Um, Older kids will probably like to have a set of those just to have something nice, fuzzy, and warm on their feet. And our last bag of this haul. Um, I saw this. Had to have it. Because I want to make a tree topper out of it. I'm not sure how I'm going to make the tree topper. But I totally want to make a tree topper because I do a little Christmas tree in here in my room. I'm not sure if I'm going to put it over here where you can see it when I do videos. Or over in the corner where I can see it. <laughs> but I'm thinking, I'm seriously thinking about maybe putting it over here. And moving these candles over there. Um, so you just have something different in the background when I do videos for December. Um, but... It's a K. They did have other, um, but they have two little hooks in here. They have two little hooks. I don't know if you can see the little hooks. They have two little hooks. One hooks here, one hooks here. So it has two separate little hooks it hooks on. But I probably won't even be using those because I'm going to be trying to make it a tree topper. So I'm going to try to do like a whole glitzy um, tree this year. And this is just the first thing that goes on it. Um, I'm also thinking about doing, like, just put, like, an ornament on it each day and be part of maybe trying to do Vlogmas where it's just putting an ornament on the tree and talking. But I don't know if that's, if that's something I would like, like Christmas memories or something like that. Please let me know down below. Um, anyway, we also found the little truck again and these gift card holders. And they're like metallic trim on here. It's so cool. The snowflake in the windows and stuff. But these are the cardboard boxes. But still, they are the little gift boxes. And if you're Looking for gift boxes, they have these in gift boxes. They also had snowmen and other things in the little gift box for um, gift cards. So if you are getting gift cards for people, this would be a totally cute little thing. But you could also use these and convert them if you're not doing gift cards. show you. You see, you get this. And that's where your gift card's supposed to go. But you could totally, if you wanted to use this as like a jewelry box, you try to turn it this way, put you a piece of the tissue paper in here, and do a jewelry box. Um, if you're giving away jewelry for Christmas.
That would totally be cute too. But whatever you're doing, because everything is convertible to convert something, but that's what it looks like. Um, the next thing in here is they do have the 15 foot garland that's kind of got like a wire to it. It's wired. So that's really good for like balconies or porches or fireplace, decorating around the fireplace. This would be kind of good to use for that. Or if you're making your own wreath. And then the last two things in here are new. And this one is actually chipped. And I bet you anything, nobody noticed it to just now. But the little snowman, um, he did have a red nose, but he don't no more. But a little snowman, it is a, you put it on your fireplace and hang your stocking from it. Where is the stocking? Stocking from it. Okay. You can hang the stocking from it. Um, but that's a little snoo person. She wrapped it. Everything. I guess she was chipped and we just can not see it. And then the other one we got. And they did have Santa Claus. Like I said, they don't do Santa uh, decorations here. We just something we don't do. But we did get a Christmas elf because he's cute with a little package. And he also has a little hanger at the front. Um, these are very um, heavy duty, so I'm thinking these might actually be okay um, not to fall off. They had some before and they fall, they fell off the fireplace, but right there, if you can see, that's totally how they're supposed to look. And you can see Santa's on it. Um, we have been looking everywhere. For this little truck right here, it's on the back of this one. See that little wooden truck? We've been looking everywhere for it. We can find it. But I'm kind of racking him back up. Well, we don't break him because the little snowman already got kind of broke. So that was Madala Tree Fall. If you like Dollar Tree Falls. Are just shopping hauls in general if, and you have not subscribed yet please do click that big red button turn it gray become part of the kitten family today because we always have room for a new kitten here please be kind to one another enjoy your day don't just enjoy your day and remember I love you very very much and I will see you in the next video Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad, prospero año.